going so I'm actually doing this particular video right now using my hey my friend Jean-Serge Gagnon here and today we're going to talk about using Snapchat for your marketing efforts for your personal branding why would you use Snapchat I mean you know lots of people say Snapchat is dead and not too many people are using it compared to the other platforms so why would you still want to use it and why am I using it every single day why do I still use it so why should you right you might want to take a pen and pad out and take a you know listen in because we're going to show you why you should be using Snapchat after this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets so in your day-to-day -day, like why would you use Snapchat right one of the things is Snapchat is one of the first platforms or maybe the first platform that had stories right the 24-hour stories now you have that on on Facebook you have that on Twitter on um, on Instagram and Snapchat and there was even it was even on uh, Twitter and on LinkedIn for a while right maybe it'll come back but why would you use that if you can do stories in Facebook if you can do stories in Instagram why or <laughs> why right so I'm going to talk about that in just a moment before I want to remind you if you're listening to the audio of this you're going to want to go check out the video we're going to talk about and show my screen and show the phone and kind of show you how to do this at cis397.jsgagnon.com where I'm going to do a blog post I'm going to share my screen obviously to show you exactly why you should be using Snapchat so let's get right to it I'm going to share my screen right now and show you the well actually right now all I have is just a, a blank screen here but I mean why would you use a Snapchat for your marketing right so or or we should say or for your personal brand right it's really for your personal brand because we're talking about doing daily stories <clears throat> or possibly just recording videos using Snapchat right so if you've been using you could you could just do stories with Instagram right with Instagram or or with Facebook right you could just record and you know that is some some say that's even better you can do those let's make that a little bit bigger here so I mean you could do it with Instagram or with Facebook and the thing is that when you're recording with the native platform you have some tools that maybe might not be in the other one like for example if you do your um your story in Instagram you can add links right link labels or link stickers to your story which I do uh, all the time and those links link stickers you can't create in Facebook right you don't have link stickers in Facebook Snapchat doesn't have link stickers either but it does have a swipe up which you uh, get right away in Snapchat but in Instagram you get that after a thousand followers right or is it 10,000 I think maybe I'm not sure but yeah 10,000 but the thing is that these different platforms has different things so why would I use like I'm going to kind of show you just what I use Snapchat for why I use it and then you can make up your own mind as to whether you think you should be using Snapchat let me just show you share my phone here so that's you know that's my phone right I have my phone in right here that's the screen of my phone right now if, uh, if I move around whatever so you can see I've got Snapchat installed on there I've got Instagram I got LinkedIn I got Facebook I got TikTok I got Pinterest I got YouTube I got Discord I got all the different apps right and and I use them every day pretty much right so what do I use why do I use Snapchat I'm going to tell you number one so why let's just type that in here so why Snapchat why Snapchat right why Snapchat number one uh videos can be 60 seconds long now you might be thinking well I can do 60 seconds on TikTok I can do 60 seconds or even three minutes on TikTok I can record a video on my phone with my with my camera app no problem and I can do that longer than I want but the thing is that 
when you're taking your video that is longer than 60 seconds and trying to share it on Facebook or Instagram it's going to kind of want you to cut it up because 60 seconds is the max there so it's a lot easier to just use Snapchat and just record for 60 seconds it'll stop when it's over and you have a 60 second video no matter what right that is why so number two uh, you can add you can use whoops you can use the cool if I'm gonna say cool because you know I think they're kind of cool and you might think they're silly but the when you're doing a your personal branding you want to be silly sometimes you want to have fun you, you want to be doing some some things that are you know out of the ordinary right so uh actually let's move this the phone a little bit to the side here I there you go so we have more room to see so you can use the cool and let's move that a little bit here there too okay the cool uh they're they're called filters they're called filters and uh, that's one thing you can do so number three there are no watermarks now that's one of the things that that's one of the reasons why I try to not use TikTok I've used TikTok before to do recordings so you can kind of you know TikTok has a really cool editor where you can pause and go record something else add something to it and then go back and add music and add text and all these different things you can do in TikTok but the problem is that whenever you do it and you save it you've got the little TikTok logo on the screen which you know is okay but if you want to share it elsewhere it's probably you know people some people will be like well why is he sharing his TikTok on Facebook or on LinkedIn or wherever right so with Snapchat there's no watermarks um and uh I mean those are the main reasons I use it the other thing is number four is you can build another following right you can build another follow so I mean those are and let me show you what I mean when I talk about all uh, this stuff okay so first of all if I go into the app like this right and I flip the camera around whoops flip it around all right so hello how's it going so you can see right now I'm in the app for Snapchat now if you don't know how to use Snapchat it's really simple the it's the same as the other apps pretty much you just press the record I'm actually going to record a 60 second video right now you're going to see how it works the the there's going to be the red bar and it's going to go and it's going to end right so if I do this I just press it like this it starts recording I'm recording right now and you can see that it's going to and it's going to end when the 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 thing reaches that 60 second mark right so that's now it just uh well actually <laughs> that's not true I forgot about that they changed that I'm recording right now no 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 I'm I'm mess I'm messing up let's just delete this sorry the each of the each of the things are 10 seconds sorry I I forgot because I use this every day and I keep just uh, you know okay so each of the t each of the turns around is a 10 second video and at the end you end up with a 60 second video if you record the whole way you end up with a 60 so that's 10 seconds then another one's going to be another 10 seconds and it's going to go until the 60 second and it's going to stop there it won't go further than you know six 10 second videos right and you can't like with snapshot you can't like pause it and like if I let go it just Each stops right it just stops so that stops it but the idea is that you you don't have to worry about oh my god am I getting close to the 60 second mark if you're trying to do a video and you're recording with your phone or something with your just your phone app right you might end up having uh you might end up having to to watch the screen or you might have to trim it after or whatever with this you do that now the other thing is the filters I was talking about right so if you, you see that little I don't know if you can see my mouse can you see my mouse no you can't I guess right here maybe no you can't even see it I'm just I got it on the other screen here but okay so there's a little face right next to the right next to the um to the little the little fella right there so the little face that's right next to the button if I press that it opens up the filter so now as you can see I got this filter I got this filter I got this filter I I don't know what this is I guess I'm a big strong man and there's a whole bunch of them now I got a cat one I got uh some you know there's some crazy stuff now the other thing you can do too with those is you can actually make them favorites you see down the bottom it says uh explore so I click on explore right here and you can see whatever there's like thousands and thousands of them right especially because with um with snapshot it's easy to create your own and and post it 
you can also see right there that they're little there's little um well I, I I wish I could show on my screen here but there's little blue dots on some of them right those are because I marked them as favorites so if I I forget how do you how do you do that over here maybe oh yeah right there so whenever you press that little eye on the top top left of your screen that little eye is going to show you what that particular snapchat filter is and you're able to favorite it by pressing the little heart and it adds it to your favorites right and oh actually it's, uh, hearts means our favorites right so these are some that I've used before with the little uh thing oh I like this one I really like this one I'm going to make this definitely a f oh it's already a favorite okay so I'm going to use this one I'm actually going to record one right now I'm going to show you how I use this recording in the rest of my stories and why I use this in a, just a minute but let's do a real recording right now that I'm actually going to keep hey how's it going so I'm actually doing this particular video right now using my phone that I'm sharing on my episode that I'm doing about snapchat how why do I use snapchat why should you use snapchat in your marketing efforts and why should I why should you use snapchat to record your stories and share them in the rest of your um, stories so I do that I do that every single day I use snapchat to do my first recording and right now like you see I'm doing this episode right now I'm actually doing this episode it's a little slow because I'm using my um a sharing screen thing on my computer see as you can see right here I've got that right there sharing on my computer as well and that's basically but anyways the thing is that I'm gonna show you why you should use snapchat to record this is you're gonna see this on Instagram on Facebook but it's recorded in snapchat and why right okay so now as you can see let me turn the volume down here so this is actually recorded now it's actually recorded on my phone and it's like you can see right now and you can also see it play right so what I first do the first thing I do after I've recorded it I save it down the bottom there's three buttons you see the one in the middle with the little arrow that goes down if you press that it saves the 60 second that I just recorded right now it saves it to my phone as a video as if I recorded with any other app right so it saves it to my phone once the little check mark is there it's saved so now that it's saved now I can post it to my snapchat story now you could add text and do things like this you can add some text so doing the video whoops doing doing snapchat video whoops I'm typing wrong so doing snapchat video while recording well I should just say use snapchat use snapchat for your story for your story okay so I put that here now this is uh, the way that snapchat works you can add text you obviously you can look up how to use snapchat and this is one of the things so you can put text and this text you know you can change it to different styles right you can uh, do that right and you can actually um move this and resize and whatever and I can I can save this right now again you see how the little check mark is gone now down the bottom now it says back down arrow again so uh part of part of course income so not income income secrets episode so now this is another one that's there I'm going to make this like this and uh, let's just do that and then I can just make it a little bit smaller put it down the bottom here so now the thing is I could save this like this and share it like that on all my you know on all my stories and see now that I've added that stuff I can put stickers a whole bunch of stuff you can do on snapchat right but I'm just going to go like this I'm going to save it again and I'm going to show you what that means but once it's saved again now it's saved with the text and it says snapchat on it whatever right so the thing is that that's one of the main things as you start off with a video you can either have it with the text you can have it without the text you can do whatever you want or you can uh, just start with the video I'll show you in a second so I'm just gonna now I'm just gonna share that to my snapchat story so I click on send now 
and up here I select spotlight I always do that you you don't have to you can just say my story but I've always posted to the snap map to my spotlight and to my story right so now if I share this it'll just upload to snapchat right so now I can go back here click, press the little x underneath the the, the circle <coughs> sorry and if I want I can show you how many views I get on my stories it's not that much but still if these are the ones I just posted now but the previous ones you know 15 and 16 and 19 so I still get a little bit of people watching my story but I don't really use snapchat that's not where I'm building my audience but you can see in the spot like a hundred people viewed this one can I see more view all snaps um 200 you know 97 100 right so that's inside of the spotlight and then there's public profile here which uh oh I guess I only have that in there I don't even know I haven't really used it but there's lots of stuff I, sh I could be using on snapchat but that's not the point I'm not using snapchat for I'm not using snapchat for the store so now it's uploaded and then I can go back to the other app so then what I do as I go to Instagram right so I'm going to go to Instagram let's load it up here and I have, I have more than one account on Instagram so I'm going to switch over to my other account which is this one here I'm going to go to my profile actually here's the thing with Instagram there is it does different things depending on whether you if you're on if I'm on my profile right now and I click on plus and I say story and then I go and I choose this video from my story right here and I I share that it's actually going to share just the first I think 20 seconds of the video it won't share more than that just the first 20 seconds I don't know why it does that there but if I go to my actual uh, page if I whoops oh I shouldn't have done that okay did that work okay so if I actually go to the to the to the Instagram feed right if I just go to the feed here then I press the plus up here that's nice and I press the plus and I press story right it's going to show me the exact same thing with my two videos you see the first one there uh is one that has the text on it and the other one has no text I'm going to use the one with the text today but you know sometimes most times I use the one without the text and I add my own text inside of Instagram but let's just do this one because it'll be faster and the thing with Instagram is that now that I've, I've uploaded a 60 second video you can see down the bottom there's four separate 20 second videos right 60 divided by by 20 is four right so there's four separate videos that are automatically split up for you and and you can go to each of these and add text on each of them that's what I usually do I go to every single one of them and I add different text on each of them but right now I'm just going to use the same one because it is you know part of course income secrets episode right down there it says use snapchat for your story and that's kind of what I'm talking about so I'm just going to just share that like this but basically you could go to each of them and add text like I said this is what I do if you watch my stories on Instagram or if you go to my stories on Facebook and you see there's something else going on on Facebook too um and I'll and we're going to get to that in a second but on Instagram I usually put different text on the on the four on the four separate 20 second stories I usually record my story in Snapchat with the intention or with the understanding that the first you know the first um half of it is is going to be um just kind of talking and then the last half is kind of promoting whatever I'm trying to promote and that's what I usually do and, the, and then here I actually add a, a link you go link right so I don't know if you saw what I just did there but up top there's little stickers right there's a speaker there's the text and then there's the little sticker thing so you press the little sticker thing and in the stickers there's a bunch of different things right but there's one that says link so you click on link right here and then you can put a link there whatever you link you want and then it'll show up on your um and then it'll, it'll show up on your video and people will be able to tap it to actually go to your uh to whatever that link is right so I'm not going to do that right now but that's kind of how I do it in this so now if I just press next it'll just say it's going to go to my story and you can send it to friends too whatever you want but I usually just use a story so I just click on share and that shares those four videos and the thing is that because it's 60 seconds and you know actually I did the math wrong right 60 divided by 4 is 15 <laughs> so 
because it's 60 seconds the first three are 20 and then the last one is less than obviously right it will be uh what is it going to be I don't it's it's always a, about 15 or 16 seconds the last one I'm not sure how it does the, the separation but I guess that's anyway so after you've done that you just click on done and then now your story is shared right so now if I go to my now now okay so the other thing is you got to look at your story right here I go to my story right now if I swipe up I can see whether it's finished uploading right I see this one's still posting and I have to wait for all four to be posted and uh, and wait for them because after they're posted then I can share them on Facebook and I'll tell and why why do I have to wait to share it on Facebook uh, why don't I just take the 60 second and share it directly on Facebook and why you know it'll split it up for me or I'll show you that in a second I don't know if it's fixed but it used to be that if you shared a 60 second video it would split it up on Facebook but the second and the rest of it would be like messed up it would be like sideways or something I'm not really sure if it still does that but all right so now if we go to Facebook right load up Facebook like this is kind of slow because of the sharing thing right but okay over here create story click click the plus now you can see these these are saved now right these are saved now on my in my uh, phone right 15 15 15 I don't know what there's yeah it'll save one for for my uh because it shares it both to Instagram and to Facebook then each of those saves a copy on my phone that's why you see two of each right um so you if I tried to share this whole video right here the 60 second video it doesn't show anywhere here I don't even know if it'll if it'll if it would work but it doesn't show a split or anything right it doesn't show oh it says right here longer videos get shortened to 26 seconds oh, okay so that's what happens now so 26 seconds I don't know why they say 26 I guess that's new so that's why I just take the 15 second ones they're not those are not going to get cut but they're already cut for me Instagram cuts them for me right I don't have to worry about taking the 60 second video and then cutting part of it that's why I do Snapchat first to record because I record a video with no um what's the word with no um watermark and I can add some stuff to it and then I can share that video right and then after I've got that video I share it to Instagram next because by sharing it to Instagram next it lets me it splits it up for me in 15 second videos like that's I was saying 20 before but it's actually 15 and that's what happens that's why you see these 15 second videos now in my phone right so if I click on this one it's gonna just share it uh, I can just click this share I can do other things if I want but I can just share it like this and now it's sharing the first one then I go plus again and because there's two of them I know that these first two are the same so the next two are the next one I share this one here then I go to the next one and I share this one which is the third one and then I share the last one which is this one right so so now I've shared the four videos on on Facebook as well right so it's like Instagram and like I said if I share if I don't and then oh and then the other thing I can do is because I did a 60 second video I can actually go into Instagram and make a reel with it right I can go on Instagram here and load it up. is it loading up there you go and I can actually make a reel right here I can say plus a reel so now I can share a reel which is you know uh, similar to and I can use the 60 second one right here and I can actually use this full one as you can see it shows me down the bottom you can do a whole bunch of other things with a reel right um but I'm just going to say add right now <coughs> and then it lets me add that video you can do more right but I'm just going to say preview and now that's my reel and I click on next and I just say you why why use snapchat uh, watch listen in listen in uh and uh so tune in tune in to find out why you why you should use you should still be using snapchat right snapchat to record 
videos videos right so I'm going to do that I could put other stuff in but I, I'm just going to go like this I'm going to share this I can add, also share the feed I can crop it whatever but I'm just going to go share recommend it on Facebook on obviously you want to be everywhere as much as you can so now I share this as a reel right so that's going to be uploading as a reel now let's go back to okay so so that's going to be uploading as a reel on tick on Instagram right so now I've got my story on Snapchat I got my story on Instagram I got my story on Facebook I got my reel on on Instagram and I can even do a reel on I can do a reel on Facebook as well so I just create a reel and the same thing uh where is it so down the bottom there's a little little thing and I just now the thing with Facebook is let's use this again the thing with Facebook is that it I don't know if they changed that or not did they if I click on next oh I don't know they used to be just 30 seconds maybe they allow it for they allow it for uh for longer so let's just go back here and say um why why should you still be using using <clears throat> using snapchat snapchat to record record videos right so why should we why should you be using snapchat to record videos I'm going to do that here share this as a reel I'm not, I don't know if it'll it's basically going to be uh, my reels it's uploading okay so the, this is you know you record once right you record once and because you can save it without any watermark like on TikTok uh, you can I can even go on TikTok and share it on TikTok too right I go over here I haven't done a video on the TikTok in a long time but this is kind of what I usually do I say plus right here and I'm just going to go photo oh no video upload right there right introducing five minute video oh wow five minutes on TikTok now that's pretty crazy I'm going to do this one here and then next and this is basically the same thing turned off what was that I didn't see what that was but anyways um so now I just do next and I can say why same thing again right why should you use snapchat snapchat to record videos so there so now I have that on TikTok as well and I can obviously I would want to put hashtags and other things and but let's just do that and I'm just going to post it uh there you go so now like I said right it's like crazy I do all of these different things I do one video and I record it on Snapchat why Snapchat because I can then share it on all these other platforms real easily real quick in this case I did one that says use Snapchat and everything it's all about using Snapchat but you know most days I don't it's not about one thing like that it's about whatever I'm talking about right like like you can see in the background here my little my little unicorn unicorniax this is an NFT that I'm working on right so I'm doing that as a as a as one of my projects right now but you know the thing is that I talk about marketing I talk about courses I talk about course income I talk about uh, personal branding attraction marketing all those different things they all have you know I I always talk about these different things on my on my episodes and I do that every day with a little short video uh for from snapchat that I record and then like I said to share it everywhere so that's really why snapchat is really this right why snapchat because you get better results you can record you have these 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 easy to record videos these 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 cool uh, effects you can use all those different things and then it's easy to share elsewhere all right I hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next episode this has been Course Income Secrets, the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon, until next time.